Hello everyone! Rox is here, coming to you to episode number 111 of our Pokemon Shining Pearl comparison let's play. On the last episode, we defeated our first uh, rematch uh, Elite Four member, Aaron. It kinda sounds wrong how I say this. I'm gonna try to find a better way to say <laughs> the intro, but yeah. Uh, the last time we defeated the bug type user Elite Four member Aaron, and on today's episode we're gonna continue with whomever's next. <laughs> I remember there's a fire type. Uh, I'm thinking about Bertha, but no Agatha, no, no Bertha. Agatha, but she's from Gen One. I don't think there's a ghost because there was Fantina. Who else? What typing is missing? Oh, we already have a grass, electric, dragon. I guess that the dragon user is Cynthia herself. Did you know that in Journeys she has a Como? <laughs> That's fun. Uh, what else? What else? There's no normal. Well, there's Whitney, but that's Gen 2. Uh, ground? We haven't seen a ground. Is there a ground? Bog. A psychic. Ghost. Fairy wasn't even a thing, so uh, there's no fairy in the form ever. But, well, oh, I'm just uh, taking way too long to start up with this episode. But yeah, uh, we're still using the same team. As you can see, I've healed them all up. Uh, Pitexos is not as full because I miscalled the addition <laughs> of instead of using the max potion, using a super root, uh, root something. Oh. I wanna name you Agatha, but Agatha is from Gen 1. So this is a ground because of the decorations. I don't remember you at all, sorry. It's Bertha! I did remember a Bertha. Interesting! <laughs> I said Bertha at the beginning of the episode. Well, well, I see you've returned, dear child. Looks as though you've grown more confident since the last time we met. But don't forget, with age comes the power to shake the earth and force of will that can split the ground beneath your feet. Ah, let this old lady show you what a little life experience can do. I like it that uh, they're not exactly the same as the gym leaders because when we uh, matched the gym leaders it was just the gym leader that was like highlighted now it's them and us as we are about to face each other Ooh, okay Whiskash uh, Lominion? No, that's not a ground type uh, what crowd types? Gastrodon, of course. Uh, I'm gonna air slash to see what we can do. Because if this thing starts, set, starts setting up dragon dances, we'll be Ice Beam. Okay, so I'm so glad I didn't switch to Terrence. It's perfect, Dave. That was a crit! Nice. Okay, let's see if uh, Dazzling Dignim does more. Because Pixie Blade. Yes! Haha. Uh -huh. I gave you some confidence that you didn't know you had. But you didn't have it in the end. <laughs> Took Beach Leon Racer 33. Golem! Interesting. The good thing about having Bullet City is that I can get around. Ah, sturdy Pokemon. Okay, now Terence, I need you to hit more than twice. Because that's all you do. Attack twice. Heavy slam. Not a rock type move. Interesting choice. Interesting choice. Earthquake. Why? Why is he faster? Why is I calling faster? Jesus Christ. <laughs> wow, I need three hits to take out the golem. Please. Thank you. I think that's the second time that's happened. Barely. Sorry, Golem. He powered on. 
pretty sure he has Ice Fang. I'm gonna put the Sleep Seed on him. I think the last time we actually lived at the Ice Fang. Yay. Who can take an Ice Fang? I don't think the Japanese are ever gonna see the light in this battle. <laughs> Unless there's another Torterra she might have. She might have a Torterra. I don't think so because Gardenia already had one. Mm, Ice Fang. Oh, I can bring Aspen! <gasps> I can freeze dry! I know that they can Stone Age and stuff like that, but Aspen's kinda bogey. It's kind of funny how the uh, sandstorm like stops for a second for you to take the damage. Okay, Bertha, I'm gonna freeze dry your boy with the freeze dry. Wow, that's enough. I was gonna say that with the freeze dry and the lead seed, it should be enough. The dextrose is level 73 and turns is also 73. I need to use the other ones so that everyone's on power. How many turns of Sandstorm? Gliscor! Interesting choice. I think he gets Brick Break and fa all the fangs he gets. Uh, I'm gonna freeze dry, it's gonna take it out. Earthquake! Makes sense. The staff's super effective. Sand Force? I don't know if he gets Sand Force. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Can the Sandstorm go? No, stop it! Even too many turns. Haha, <laughs> my beaver may be in sight. Right, Period! Oh my god. You know what? I'm gonna waterfalls. If it's a weakness, what is the agility? Oh my god, I did nothing! Rock Wrecker! Jesus Christ! I'm so sorry, Aspen! <laughs> You're so dead. Well, I think that's the first time we've seen the animation for Rock Wrecker. Oh, the Sandstorm raises the special defense. I forgot about that. Yeah, because that, that did so little damage. I think I have to bullet it. I hope for the best. If not, I can Brick Break. If not, I can... Night Slash. <laughs> With you, I can't touch you. Or oh, Dazzling Gleam. Yeah, it turns I think it's your turn. The cool thing is that the Rock Wrecker, uh, he needs a turn to recharge. Let's put it seed. Blah, blah, blah. I need three again. Please. Oh no, just two. Thank you. Oh my god. Riperior, nice! Elite 4 Bertha. That was quite something. Your youth gives you a confidence in battle that can't be shaken. Okay, now let's uh, check out what her whole team was. No matter how the world uh, shifts, you and your Pokémon will always uh, be sure-footed. You're steadier today than all the days before. Uh, okay, so here it is, uh, Bertha's team, uh, Elite 4 Bertha, Bertha ground type. Bertha's team doesn't change that much, with Suruworo being replaced by Gliscor and Quagsire by Rhyperior. Yeah, I knew he had a Quagsire. This team gets even tougher with Mamos Wine added. What? What Mamos Wine? And the Nido King replacing Golem in the stronger match, bringing the coverage that take out the grass type and water types. Oh! There's even a tougher battle in the Elite Four! Now, please tell me if you want to, uh, to see that. Uh, maybe I'll do it to make this uh, <laughs> even longer than it should be. But yeah, uh, we have Whiskash with uh, the Rindo Berry. For sure, he had the Rindo Berry. 
Hydration, Brave Nature with Earthquake, Ice Beam, Scald, and Zen Headbutt. Glyscore, Hypercutter, interesting. Adamant with Citrus Berry, Earthquake, Thunderfang, Guillotine, and Exhisor. Wow, kind of wild that she has a guillotine. Golem, Sturdy with Jolly Nature's of Sand. Rock Polish, Heavy Slam, Earthquake, and Stone Edge. Uh, Hippowdon, Sandstream with Ice Fang, Earthquake, Crunch, and Rest. Resto Chesto, Berry, Adamant Nature. Rhyferior, Solid Rock. Maybe that's also why he took the water pulse that good. With Earthquake, Rock Wrecker, Mega Horn, and the Thunder Fang. Muscle Band. Wow. Adamant Nature. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna check if in the original games they were rematches. Because I didn't check out... Uh, I know that the, the gym leaders didn't have a rematch in the original games. Mm. No, I don't think there is. And let's take out of the brilliant. Brilliant. Nope. Indeed, for Platinum Rematch. I don't think there is. Well, that was... This battle was kind of fast. But I'm not gonna do another one because I've already made my choice of making one Elite Four per episode. So, I'm gonna wrap up the episode right here. And on the next one, we're gonna continue with the next Elite Four. And I'm gonna say that it's gonna be Wagner's brother, but... Just because that's the only one I, I'm thinking that it's left. <laughs> so I guess for now that's it. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Leave a like if you did. And it's time. Trap it up. Bye bye.